The Foxbat is already an excellent short takeoff aircraft. However, this video shows a technique in which you can cut that takeoff distance by as much as half. First, let's look at a normal takeoff. You don't need flap on the Foxbat, but one stage is more than enough. Apply full power over a count of five, lifting the nose wheel slightly off the runway as you do so. In this attitude, the aircraft will take off in about 75 to 100 meters, depending on your takeoff weight, indicating about 40 to 45 knots. Climb out as normal at 55 to 60 knots. Next, let's look at a short field takeoff. Line up the aircraft on the runway and hold the brakes on. No flaps needed at this stage. Apply full power, holding the aircraft on the brakes. When maximum RPM is reached and stabilized, release the brakes but don't lift the nose. As the ASI, the airspeed indicator, goes through about 25 knots, firmly pull on full flap and gently nudge the controls back to lift the aircraft off the runway. With only one person on board, the plane will build speed quickly and you can climb away at 45 to 50 knots. With two people on board, you may need to stay in ground effect a bit longer before climbing away at 50 to 55 knots. With one person or two on board, remove the flap one stage at a time when it's safe to do so. This short field technique is useful if you need to quickly get off a rough or sticky paddock and of course where the takeoff distance is limited. The procedure may not work on all aircraft types and the secret of success on the Fox Spat, as always, is practice, practice and practice.